Hey guys, so today is the day before closing. We are at the new property and we got some stuff in the house just for today. Got uh, one sofa bed, well, one bed, twin bed, and some blankets and stuff. So yeah, so I have somewhere to sleep tomorrow night, I guess. I'm not sure if I'm going to keep it there or somewhere else. So, uh, yeah, it looks pretty decent. One of the things that I'll do at some point is probably repaint. I'm not too crazy about the colors, but that can wait. And probably the floors. I'm not that crazy about the floors, but, you know, they're okay for now. Uh, the kitchen actually looks bigger than what I remember. And uh, my favorite thing in this kitchen is this thing freaking giant pantry hey, hey. Let's get the light on. so yeah like I said it's a giant pantry I don't know I'm not sure how big it is it's like, like 8 feet deep or something I gotta measure it but plenty of space plenty of space and again the kitchen looks bigger than what I remember actually um, the fridge is going to go there on Monday. The, uh, the oven is decent, you know, it's electric. I don't know if I'll replace it at some point, but we'll see. And it's got a dishwasher, you know, also pretty basic. I might replace that. Uh, the former owner took the washer and dryer. I'm not sure if they're going to take that or not. We'll see. And just another quick little walk around here. Just to show you the master bedroom. I have decided for sure to uh, replace these carpets. They are a little stained. So that will be something that I do right away. The carpets go into that room there. But it's a good sized room. It's a good sized room. It's got a good vibe. And I think because this room does not have the dark thing on the bottom, you know, I'm not you know, in a rush to change these colors. I think it's just over there. I don't like the dark over there. Anyway, this is the uh, master bathroom. Also looking pretty good. Water is on. All the water seems to be working. And pretty big shower. Double heads. And I think my birds are gonna like this shower. Ha ha. My birds need a bath. Get them up here pretty soon. And this is the uh, guest area, you know, guest bathroom. I already tested the sinks. They're working, you know, looking pretty decent. Looking pretty decent. Good size. It's got the little shower rod. Get some, get a shower curtain for that. And uh, the two guest rooms. So one of these is going to be a dedicated guest room. I haven't decided which one. So we're going to call this this one here bedroom number two. And I'm going to call this bedroom number three. So if anybody cares to put a comment, let me know which one you prefer as the guest room. This is facing the front of the house. Facing the front of the house. And the other one's facing the back of the house. I got to say that my favorite thing about the house is this little deck. This little porch. I mean, it's not anything fancy. You know, it's a pretty basic design, but it's a good size. It's got the little lights up there, and at night it looks really nice. So it'll be a nice little place to hang out, you know. And uh, over there, that's the official parking area. And maybe at some point I'll either put a carport or a garage or something over there. And this area here, it's kind of hard to see. But it, it's, it's sloped. It goes from there. It goes down that way. So over here... Over here, you got a little bit of a slope. You can see where the van's kind of slope. Maybe maybe do something over here to level it out. And maybe put a retainer wall over there. Maybe, you know, that's for later. And look, he's even throwing in a birdhouse. No charge. Uh, you can't really see them, but up in these trees, there are some big birds up there. And these two trees I may have to cut. I don't like the way they're sitting. This back area... 
at some point do something with it in this pool. I'm not sure if I'm going to get rid of it or clean it. We'll decide later. That storage house. Originally, he said he was going to take the storage house. But now he's saying that he might want to leave it or sell it to me or whatever. So we might. We might buy it. We'll see. I think it's locked. It's actually open. It's, it's a good size uh, storage box. I mean, not not ginormous. I don't know, like looks like maybe ten by twelve. We'll see how much he wants for it. Uh, if I take it, I probably need to set up some kind of ramp so that maybe I can get the motorcycle in there. We'll see. And I'm not sure if I showed this in the last video, but see where the trees are back there. It goes back like another sixty feet. Another 60 feet beyond the trees. So where the tree line is, it's like another 60 feet. Yeah, so this shed, I don't know. Maybe I should keep it. We'll make a decision. Alright, well that's it for today. Uh, oh, yeah, I got a little flower garden. A little flower bed over here. Definitely need some work. But at least we got an area we could, you know, maybe plant some flowers and put down some mulch to make the whole thing look a little nicer. And then maybe underneath that, that could be maybe storage or something. Again, you know, all these things could be figured out. All right, so tomorrow's closing. Hopefully everything goes well, and hopefully tomorrow night this will be mine.